Today's verse is from Mark chapter 8 verse 35 and it uh, talks about holding on to your life and losing it and losing it for God's sake, you'll save it. And it reminded me of a story where a man falls off a cliff, he manages halfway down to grab hold of a root and is holding on really quite tightly. In fact, he's probably hanging on for dear life. Can't go down, can't go up. And at that point, he realises he perhaps he ought to pray. Um, so he prays, is anybody up there? If anybody's up there, please, could you tell me what to do? I'm, I'm, I need help. And he hears a voice saying, let go, I'll catch you. And the man thinks about it for a bit. Uh, could you not just let down a rope and I'll tie it around me and you could pull me up? The voice says, let go, I'll catch you. And the man thinks about it for a bit longer, hanging on for dear life. Um, could you not just like phone the emergency services um, and a nice fireman might be able to come down and get me? The voice says, let go, I'll catch you. The man thinks about it for a little bit longer and then says, is anybody else up there? Now, all I was to tell you was to get you to think about the fact that actually this guy is hanging on for dear life. He can't go anywhere. He can't do anything. Both hands are, are, are tied up. They can't do anything. He's not living. Um, but let go and let God lose your life for the sake of the gospel and because of him. And he will save it. He will catch you. Um, you won't crash and burn on the stones below at the bottom of the cliff. He'll catch you and, and he will put his arms around you. He'll hold you and he will lift you up on wings as eagles. And then we will soar. And that's real life, not hanging on for dear life. It's giving life to God and he gives it back to us in abundance.